Hello, I'm Silver. We will learn about outer planets in the solar system. As before we learned about the first four planets and a moon, we talked about its astrological symbol, its temperature range, and its gravity. To do the same thing, let's continue to our solar system. We will discuss Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, and Pluto. These are the last five planets. Let's start with Jupiter. Jupiter is the fifth planet from the Sun and the largest in the solar system. It is a gas giant with a mass one thousandth that of the Sun, but two and a half times that of all the other planets in the solar system combined. Its astrological symbol is about Jupiter's thunderbolt or eagle. Its orbiting time takes about 12 years. Its gravitational speed is about 25 meters per second squared. It is difficult to walk and its weight is two and a half times as heavier than Earth. Jupiter is primarily composed of hydrogen with a quarter of its mass being helium, though helium comprises only about a tenth of the number of molecules. Jupiter has 79 known moons, including the four large Galilean moons discovered by Galileo Galilei in 1610, namely Europa, Ganymede, Io, and Callisto. Next, the sixth planet Saturn. It is the second largest in the solar system, after Jupiter. It is a gas giant with an average radius of about nine times that of Earth. It only has one-eighth the average density of Earth, however, with its larger volume, Saturn is over 95 times more massive. Its astrological symbol is Saturn's sickle. Its orbiting period is about 29.45 years, its gravitation is about 10.44 meters per second squared. Saturn's rings are thought to be pieces of comets, asteroids, or shattered moons that broke up before they reached the planet, torn apart by Saturn's powerful gravity. They are made of billions of small chunks of ice and rock coated with another material such as dust. Saturn is a gas giant because it is predominantly composed of hydrogen and helium. It lacks a definite surface, though it may have a solid core. Saturn's rotation causes it to have the shape of an oblate spheroid, that is, it is flattened at the poles and bulges at its equator. Next, Uranus, the seventh planet in the solar system. Its name is a reference to the Greek god of the sky, Uranus, who, according to Greek mythology, was the grandfather of Zeus and father of Cronus. It has the third largest planetary radius and fourth largest planetary mass in the solar system. Its astrological symbol is derived from a combination of the Mars and Sun symbols. Its orbiting time period is about 84 years, and its gravitation speed is about 8.87 meters per second squared. Uranus' atmosphere is similar to Jupiter's and Saturn's in its primary composition of hydrogen and helium but it contains more ices such as water, ammonia, and methane, along with traces of other hydrocarbons. It has the coldest planetary atmosphere in the solar system, with a minimum temperature of negative 371 degrees Fahrenheit, and has a complex, layered cloud structure with water thought to make up the lowest clouds and methane the uppermost layer of clouds. Thus, life cannot be survived in that planet. Next. The eighth planet Neptune, looks similar to Uranus, is also a blue planet. It is the farthest known solar planet from the Sun. It is the fourth largest planet by diameter, the third most massive planet, and the densest giant planet. It is 17 times the mass of Earth, slightly more massive than its near twin Uranus. Its astrological symbol is Neptune's trident. Its orbiting time takes about 160 years so far. The gravitation speed of Neptune is about 11.15 meters per second squared. Neptune's atmosphere is composed primarily of hydrogen and helium, along with traces of hydrocarbons and possibly nitrogen, though it contains a higher proportion of ices such as water, ammonia, and methane. However, similar to Uranus, its interior is primarily composed of ices and rock. Uranus and Neptune are normally considered ice giants to emphasize this distinction. 
And finally, the ninth planet in the solar system Pluto. Pluto is a dwarf planet in the Kuiper Belt, a ring of bodies beyond the orbit of Neptune. It was the first and the largest Kuiper Belt object to be discovered. Its astrological symbol is about PL monogram for Pluto and Percival Lowell. Its orbiting takes nearly 250 years so far and its gravitation speed is 0.62 meters per second squared, closer to zero, as the zero gravity in the outer space. Pluto was discovered by Clyde Tombaugh in 1930 and declared to be the ninth planet from the Sunday Pluto has five known moons, Charon, the largest, with a diameter just over half that of Pluto, Styx, Nix, Kerberos, and Hydra. Pluto and Charon are sometimes considered a binary system because the very center of their orbits does not lie within either body. In September 2016, Astronomers announced that the reddish-brown cap of the North Pole of Charon is composed of tholins, organic macromolecules that may be ingredients for the emergence of life, and produced from methane, nitrogen, and other gases released from the atmosphere of Pluto and transferred 12,000 miles to the orbiting moon. Now we've talked everything about planets in the solar system. For more information about planets from Google Maps, Log on to google.com slash map slash space slash name of the planet. So now we've learned about outer planets of the solar system. Like, comment, and subscribe now.